या वेलकम बैक टू एक्सपेरिमेंट नंबर फोर विच इज आइजन वैल्यू बकलिंग ओके वी हैव सॉल्व इट एंड नाउ क्लिक ऑन द डिफॉर्मेशन वन एंड सी द हाउ द पाइप इज डिफॉर्म यू कैन एनिमेट दिस रिजल्ट या नाउ द डिफॉर्मेशन जी इज अबाउट और इट इज अबाउट द एक्स वाई प्लेन स्टॉप द डिफॉर्मेशन नोट ऑन द वैल्यूज ऑफ डिफॉर्मेशन मैक्सिम डिफॉर्मेशन Now click on the deformation number two, and again you can animate these results. Now this is about different plane. Okay, uh, the deformation uh, happening is in in the same way, but it is about the another axis. Now uh, uh, take the screenshot of this, and uh, again you can note down the values. Now click on the deformation number three, and say animate. now this is a different mode of vibration or deformation and see that the values of total deformation also had changed okay now you can stop this uh, stop this animation and again take the screenshot and note on the value of deformation again click on the fourth deformation again play button now this is again a different mode of vibration but about a different axis okay value of the deformation is same so now we'll perform the third uh, step of this practical so go back to the main window and again click on the static structural and uh, you have to keep left button pressed okay drag it on the screen see how many options it is uh, selecting uh, how many options are getting red again on the second uh, second option okay uh, how many options are getting red Uh, it is at the model and uh, and the and release the left button uh, uh, on the second option itself okay don't release it somewhere else it will not create the connection that we want okay and now here under setup right click and say edit yes now it it is now uh, in the third stage see it is taking the earlier results now again here we have to uh, uh, insert insert and uh, see the fix support so where is the fix support yeah fix support and again reorient the figure yeah now this is the bottom okay you have to fix this bottom to so select this bottom say apply and again we have to apply the force so right click insert and say force Okay, it is on the on the another phase. Just reorient the figure. Yeah, on this phase we have to apply the force. So select this phase. Say apply. Uh, change the type to ve from vector to component, and uh, give input as a Z component. So it is minus one zero two seven zero five five. Okay, and in the analysis setting. click in click on the analysis setting and change the uh, options okay as per the uh, lab manual so i will show you how they are so i am taking steps to be 1000 okay and uh, yes this uh, step time auto step time i am changing on to on option yes and it is defined by time yes okay and the minimum uh, step is 5 okay maximum to be 10 yeah again it has changed the option so it is 5 initial step time maximum uh, it is 10 okay So it is not taking the option because uh, it is taking few more seconds, and here you have to change the deformation to large deformation to on. Okay, and uh, these are the options under this uh, analysis setting. Uh, just verify the the inputs from the lab manual, and under solution, right click, insert deformation uh, total, and solution insert. stress in the uh, stress normal stress again in the normal stress change the value to z axis okay just will confirm this analysis settings okay so 
so go back to lab manual i think i have made a few wrong entries let's correct them first yeah so this is the so the initial step is 1 uh, current step is 1 end time is 1000 second so i'm changing it yes and this is setting yeah initial step is 1 and this total time is to be 1000 second okay and uh, are you one tap are you one and this is tap right okay now it is not a yellow and uh, we have done with the settings just right click on the solution and say solve again it will solve the problem few uh, seconds it will take so wait uh, or you can you can skip this section and directly go to the results so now it is getting solved as now uh, this is a uh iteration these are the iterations and uh, these are to be performed for 100 seconds so it is taking time you can uh, go through this options once again see uh, the in number of step is 1 current step is 1 the uh, initial yeah the step end time is 100 here you have to uh, auto time stepping you have to say on and it should be defined by time okay and initial uh, times it is 5 second minimum time 1 second and maximum to be 10 second and for last deformation you have to say on okay you have to keep that option on still it is doing So let it do. So take the photograph of this image, and then uh, try to input this data in the analysis. Still, it is uh, saying overall progress is only fifty percent. every time it prepares a mathematical model and then it again solves it then writes the results okay that's how the iterations are performed yeah now the solution is done so let us see the solution so click on the deformation and uh, see the maximum value of deformation it is uh, 3.2 you can animate these deformations by just clicking on this play button okay and uh, then uh, also you can take the image of this and again uh, for the stress uh, select this normal stress option uh, which is in the z direction see the direction is z and again click on the play button to animate these results okay and the maximum value is minus 3 uh, 32 uh, pascal mega pascal okay yeah and uh, we have to also see see the force and displacement conversions so click on the solution information and under solution information uh, click in the solver output and select the force conversions okay and uh, see the uh, graph is generated so let me just click on this graph for you yes that's how the graph can be